Today I learned that since 2010, New Yorkers have been complaining more. I'm Rodemeyer, Google Developer Advocate. Join me now as I explore the trends from the past six years of New York City 311 calls with BigQuery. Most complaint types have seen an increase, but they're not consistently distributed, and many categories have actually seen a decrease. The most significant complaint increases are related to cars, noise, and garbage. The most striking are those related to parked cars. Frankly, I'm amazed anyone even tries to park in New York City. Illegal parking complaints are up over 400%, representing nearly 100,000 additional calls. That by itself is almost a third of the total increase since 2010. Blocked driveways and derelict vehicles represent another 100,000 extra calls, so it's clear that people just don't know where to leave their cars. Note that there is also a sharp increase in broken parking meter complaints, so some people at least are trying to do the right thing. Noise complaints have always accounted for the most 311 calls. They've now more than doubled since 2010 with over 200,000 additional calls in 2016, which represents nearly 18% of all calls. There's also notable increases in complaints about homeless encampments, dirty sidewalks, and missed garbage pickups, and a possibly not unrelated increase in rat sightings. Thankfully, the trend hasn't been entirely one way, with many complaint types seeing significant decreases. The city walls are looking cleaner with complaints about graffiti and illegal postering both down, and illegal postering specifically down nearly 80%. Broken streetlights and faulty traffic signals are both down around 50%, possibly related to the gradual introduction of LEDs, and street repairs seem to be failing far less often. We can also see that each borough has evolved in its own way. Here I'm looking at the complaint types that have increased or decreased at a significantly different rate in one borough compared to the others. In Brooklyn, for example, derelict vehicle complaints are more than 60% higher than the other boroughs. Manhattan saw the largest growth in complaints, and as you can see, really drove some of the categories with the biggest increases, particularly for noise and illegal parking. It also went against the trend for graffiti, street cave-ins and faulty pedestrian signals, getting worse where the other boroughs all saw an improvement. In the Bronx, complaints about loud music on the street and coming from cars have grown at around twice the rate of the other boroughs. Meanwhile in Queens, complaints about poor street conditions including potholes and cracked roads are up 10% against a 5% downwards trend everywhere else. Finally, in Staten Island, the alleys are even dirtier and broken streetlights are up against the trend. Remember that in every case here we're measuring the change in the number of complaints. You'd expect an increase in complaints to correlate with more problems, but it's possible that people are just complaining more. I've cherry-picked what I thought were the most interesting trends, but they are by no means comprehensive. As always, your first terabyte of processing each month is free, so I invite you to open up BigQuery and do your own trend investigations on this and all our other public data sets and share your results with us using the Today I Learned with BigQuery hashtag. And as always, subscribe to our channel and follow our blog to learn something new every week with BigQuery.